Hello guys and girls, my name is Mr. Orange and welcome everybody to Red Dead Redemption 2. So Molly wants to speak to us about something and we're gonna go towards her and ask her if she needs any help. So that's what we're gonna do right now. So Molly's all the way there behind this tree and I think she needs a little bit of help because uh, she's really quiet, let's say. So we're gonna go towards her and just, you know, speak to her if, uh, if there's anything... Uh, happening to her or if everything is fine with her so we're gonna go nicely towards her T towards her okay i don't know what i'm saying but okay here, here she is okay let's speak to molly let's greet her yes miss o'shea ah call me molly would you oh. arthur how is dutch i mean how does he seem to you i'm about the same as usual i guess i i really love him you know but if he, like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip-off, so now I can yeah. risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur, bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so. <laughs> but you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you talking about? Arthur's above a little stick-up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said. Hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. <laughs> well, I got a serious medical condition. <laughs> yes, you are a compulsive liar. No need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church, before it connects... With the rest of the wagon train, very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. Oh my god. <laughs> this is going to be great. Come on then, you miserable bastards. Well, I'm already behind you. Come on, everybody. Get wind of this, old man. We only been down here all of five minutes. Well, while you boys went off fishing or playing lawman or whatever the hell you've been doing. I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Finding the nearest grog house. Hey, if you don't want in on this, Williamson, that's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee-high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you scoped here exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. Sounds okay, interesting. Up here. We should cover our faces. Oh, they'll be that might be a good idea. So I'm actually gonna go and uh, equip our b bandana. Who's up ahead? When? Soon, Williamson. Christ's sakes. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. That sounds like a fair plan. You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> oh, there it is. Let's go. We're going straight towards it. Oh, which way they're going? I said, stop the damn wagon! Whoa! Now, don't try anything stupid, and we won't do anything unkind. You know, boys, I, I don't, I don't want to get shot. But this is a mistake. I work for Cornwall Kerosene and Tar. Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Oh, great. So you know him? <laughs> Who doesn't? I hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much. Oh, he'll miss it. Okay. Why don't you check out around the back? Okay, well, I'm, a, I'm actually going to check it. Help me out here. Yeah, I'm going to rob the wagon. Can I help you out? Okay, let's search this chest first. Come on. Oh, a metal safe. Nice. 
There better be some money. Oh, yes, there is. Okay, we're looking good. Must be nearly a thousand here. That's very nice. Shit! Hey! Think I see something! Oh, great. Let's go! Arthur, let's go! Yeah! And that's what happens. <laughs> and there's a lot of them behind us. Where, where are they? Oh crap, there's so many of them. Come on, keep going. Come on, where's my gun? For some reason I don't have my gun anymore. Okay, uh, where's my gun? I need my... Oh, that's a lot of them. Okay, I don't know where I'm going. I'm shooting them, man! Ow, this hurts. Okay, we got one. There's still many more behind us. Oh, crap. There's a wagon. This is not looking good. Okay, do you have a bigger, bigger gun that I can use? Doesn't look like it. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's one right there. Crap, keep going. Come on, reload. Got him. Is there more behind us? I think we lost them. I shot a lot of uh, people back there. Well, sir, I think we already lost them. Get off the trail. Into the woods. Into the woods. Oh, are we gonna stay in the shack? Oh no, this is not gonna turn out great. Get out of here. Come on, get off. Get out of sight. Stay until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watch for now. Sure. Well, we uh, get some rest. Uh. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Let's try and get out of here. Hey. Shit. Absolutely. Well, shut up, old man. Well, look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light over by the house. Damn. I hate it. Now, let's just keep this calm. See what happens. Oh, no. Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear nothing? I... I... Why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? Like, Clint, tell me what you heard. I don't... Uh, maybe I, I heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. Oh, no. Why did you tell that? It better not be. All right. Coop forth. Lo, go check out the, the barn. Sir. Oh, no. They're going to come. They're coming? Yes, they're coming. This is not looking good. Okay, we need to we need to be quiet. I don't know how I, are we gonna get away with this, but if we if we get away with this, then I'm then I'm surprised. So looks deserted enough. Sure. You head inside. I'll go around the back. Oh crap. Just don't move. Place looks empty to me. And the old guy up there is full of crap. Yeah, I don't think they're here. Don't see any horses. Come on, let's head back. Boss! Place is empty! Shit! Oh, crap! Okay, never mind. Looks like we're shooting our way out of here, fellas. Oh, yes, we are. Okay, where are they? Looks like Mr. Cornwall's 
Oh yes. There's a lot of them. We got more of the bastards on this side. Oh, more of them? Oh, come on, shoot. Keep shooting. Oh yes, look at us go. Now we're doing amazingly. Uh, where? Oh, there's a guy hiding behind. Hey, how am I not getting you? Ow, 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 ow. Okay, my health is really low. Okay, is there more? There's just still one more. That might be a great idea. Okay, this gun is not great. Okay, I need a better gun. Uh, do we have anything else? No, I only have this one. God damn it, it's not a good one. It's not... Okay, great. Is there more? Oh, crap. Come on. Come on, hide. Oh, no. This is not a... Gotcha. Finally. Crap, crap. Headshot. Okay, where? Come on. How'd you... How did I die? Oh my god, this gun is so bad. Come on! This gun is trash. I need a revolver. This gun is literally trash. What? Where's the fire? Oh no, this place is catching on the fire. Hide, hide, hide. Gotcha. Oh yeah, the fire, fire spreading. Come on, hide. Everyone still breathing. I am you would be. Ain't you glad now I insisted you come along? How many is there more coming of them? How many Oh yes, so many Finally. Got that guy. We don't get out of here soon. We're Well then we are trapped basically. Oh crap, this is not looking good. Run! Come on, we have to get the heck out. We have to we have to go. Okay, go that way. Let's head the woods! Oh run, 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 run. Are they behind us? Oh yes, there are. Where, where are all of our horses? Don't say they took our horses also. Oh no, this is not, this is not gonna turn out great. Oh no. Why, why do you want to split up? What rocks? Oh, these ones? Okay, thank you. They're coming this way. Perfect. We need to do this quietly. You take the left and I'll take the right, okay? You're right or my right? Shh. Okay, let me just pull out my revolver. In three, two, one. Okay, there you go. We got them. Is there more coming? Oh, yes, they do. They have a lot of trouble. Oh, there's our... Is that our horse? No, that isn't. Oh, yes, they're in big trouble. Come on. Oh, why are you so bad, Revolver? I need the shotgun. Even the shotgun is not going through the tree. Peek out. Gotcha. Finally. Is there more? Oh, yes, there is. Okay, got that guy. 
there more? Yes. One more guy. Where is he? Can't seem to find him. Where is he? I can't see him. Oh, there he is. Come out. Gotcha. Did we do it? We all still alive. Yeah, just about. Yeah, I'll deal with you later. We got some money, didn't we? Sure, but now we got corn on our backs. It was an honest mistake. Hey, leave it, Gwonk. Get out of here. Every man split up, Gwonk. Run, quick. Good luck, Jones. Stay quiet and move. Well, at least we got a lot of money, but that wasn't really successful. <laughs> and for some reason, we're in the middle of nowhere, so that's just great. And while we're at it, we might also go to the gun store and do a couple of stuff to our gun. Because uh, I have a small feeling that our guns are not really that great. Oh, looks like we have some uh, some animals here that I, that I might actually get here if I can. If I switch, if I can switch to my... Uh, Okay, where's my bow and arrow? I'm, okay, we don't have it. Oh, that's sad. Okay, so what I really want to quickly do is where is our... Uh, okay, let me go here. So here's our bow and arrow. Uh, let me go ahead and pick, uh, take, it, take it from there. There we go. Let me try to find some animals. Okay, I think they, I think they already ran away, so... Well, looks like we're not gonna go hunting, but still. That was an opportunity. But okay, uh, we're gonna go into our map and let's look for the closest that we are right now at. Uh, looks like our camp is the closest. And uh, Leopold Strauss needs also our help, so we're gonna go towards there. It's a little side mission, so why not? We're gonna go and uh, see if he needs any help also. Okay guys, so we are back at our camp after a uh, sort of long journey. And now we are headed to Strauss, if he's still there and not sleeping. Okay, a horse is getting tired, but that's about it. Here we are. Supplies is still really good. I'm happy that everything is still sort of in the white and the yellowish area. So, uh, camp funds are also really good. It's not bad. We got, uh, some money left. So, uh, we're gonna stow the horse, and where is my good person, uh, Strauss? Okay, he's sitting there, just, uh... Doing his work, like always. Hi there. Let me just go ahead and uh, greet you. Ah, Herr Morgan. Herr Strauss. How are you enjoying yourself here? Well enough, I guess. And you? Well, it turns out the pursuit of freedom is not a cheap business. Not for us, and not for some of the locals. Shocking already. I prefer to call it banking. You ain't the one handing out the beatings. No, but I am the one feeding the women and children in the camp. What choice do we have, Mr. Nah, Morgan? I don't know. Well, come on, then. Tell me who. Here's the list. Refinery worker turned hunter by the name of Vinton Holmes. You'll find him up in the hills north of Strawberry. Ah, an apprentice undertaker. This one working in rows. His name was... Gwen Hughes. And how many of them do you think will be able to pay? <laughs> With enough encouragement, both of them. <laughs> Strauss is such an evil man. <laughs> I just have to say that. He is a such an evil man. So, uh, looks like he told us that he's all the way in this town. Or, I don't know what did he told us, but okay. Well, <laughs> at least he told us... Uh, so the individual that owned the gang money is marked on... Okay, so that's convenient. Now we can go onto the map and see. Okay, so it's right here in this town. So that's convenient. So we're gonna also... So now we have to go all the way back to the town and uh, talk to this person that has to pay our... That... No, that... You know, that still has to pay us. So he's not gonna get his money for free. So... Oh, also forgot about something. We could have also uh, donated our... Uh, or a boar hide that we got. So, still, I'm, I'm still gonna keep it. We might go back at our camp eventually, but I'm still gonna keep it on our horse. So now we're off to the town, and the uh, person has to pay up. And uh, I'm hoping that we're also gonna stay there because I also might also do some upgrades on our weapon and uh, clean some of our weapons because I think that might affect some of our uh, weapons damage. Because I'm having a small feeling that some of the, some of our pistols and revolvers and or rifles don't have that much damage as before. Here we are at the town. We 
can't uh, can't use any weapons because of the trouble. Okay, doesn't matter. Okay, so here it is. The guy is somewhere around here. Is that the guy? Let's greet the stranger. You okay? <laughs> Do I look okay? <laughs> no. You look awful. Ugh. Awful. Look at me. Useless. I wasn't born to this. I didn't deserve this. I used to be a gentleman. Jeremiah Compson. Compson Stead. Good for you. If that's anything to boast about. They took everything from me. Who did? They. And what did they take? My whole life. A whole way of living a career. I stole a lot of things, but that's quite a lot to steal. Look at me here, living in the shit and in the mud. I'm sorry. <laughs> my old house. The house my grandfather built. It's all dilapidated and destroyed. Repossessed by the bank. I'm sorry to hear that. I was supposed to live a different life. Me too. If only I could get my old things back. Personal mementos, a watch, old pistol, my ledger. Where's this house again? Compson Stead, it's a north of Scarlet Meadows. <laughs> Bank says I can't go near it. I'm living rough over by Aris Field. Well, if I'm ever out that way, I'll see what I can do. Time. Time is hell. Oh, yes, it is. What a nice guy, Arthur. So, looks like the stranger's house is, like, captured about about something, or something happened to his house. And looks like, I think... Oh, no! I think... No, that's not it. Is that the person? I'd, sh I'd sure appreciate that help, mister. Well, I will, but the problem is the... The money question mark is still here, so I don't know. This is sort of weird, but okay. Um, so where is this place that uh, that he's talking about? So it's all the way there. That's really far. Uh, break into compost house. Yeah, I think we're not gonna do that. But still, it's, it's a good thing that we asked him. So while we're at it, uh, we're also gonna go and. Uh, oh no, it's right here. This place. Never mind. We actually asked the wrong stranger. Okay, so it's this house. Uh, let's see. So it's a workshop or some sort. Uh, let's pat him. What a good horse. All by himself. Okay. I think that horse is okay, but yeah. Uh, is anybody home? It might be a good question to ask, maybe. Still don't look quite right. Oh. There's somebody behind the house, I think? Did I hear something? Oh, yes, he's behind. Let's ask this guy. I ain't never gonna get the hang of this. When use? Start picking out a box for yourself if you don't got that money, you owe Leopold Strauss. I, I don't. I, I, I need more time. Doesn't everybody? That casket for you? But you want another? Wait, 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 wait. I, I, I can get it for you. But uh, well uh. Come with me to the churchyard. Uh, why? Hmm? Alright. What are you gonna do at the church? Oh, this ain't right. I, I mean, I I'll get you your money, but, uh... Oh, well, you'll see. What ain't right is borrowing money you can't pay back. I, I guess, I guess, I guess you you're correct, but, uh... This, it, it ain't exactly right, what we're doing. You ain't the first to put his hand in the collection box, and you won't be the last. Rest a little easier knowing church has been taking more than they need off poor folks since time began. Well, like I said, well, the morality of the matter is a little more confusing than that. <sighs> oh my god, this is... I don't know what is he gonna do. Don't okay. say he's gonna steal something th from the church. the church. I'll keep watch. Well, it ain't in there. It's under here. I'm digging up Mrs. Claypole. Oh Jesus. no! Well, she got a bunch of jewels in there that she don't need. 
Jesus, man. Why? That's the most that's the most disrespectful thing that you can ever do. Oh, damn it. There's a bunch of people here. Oh, I got it. I got it. Look, you clear them off and I'll wait right around here. But don't okay. hurt nobody. Oh, I you know. Don't, no fuss. don't worry. Yeah, I will not hurt anybody. Just Let's ask these people. You. you two might want to find somewhere a little more private. We was fine until you got here, mister. Good day now. Whoa, okay, that's not a right thing to say. Go. Get out of here, kids. Move. Come on. I knew we shouldn't have been here. You missed your chance, boy. Oh, and there's a lady just crying about, yeah, by her loss. Uh, let's charm her up. Ma'am, would you mind clearing out of here for some uh, maintenance work? Oh, gladly. About time this place got cleaned up. <laughs> well, it looks like it. Okay, so I think every, everybody's clear, cleared up, cleared up of this church. So now uh, he can it's do his clear. work. All right. Now go watch the gate. I'll get to this, uh, this exhumation. Okay, so now we have to be a guard. Hey, you have to pay that for us. You better pay us good because we're now we're protecting the, the church from him, so nobody can see him steal the stuff. Okay, so the lady's going. The problem is also Arthur is looking really tired right now, if you cannot tell. So we should have maybe got we should have maybe go and take him some sleep right now, but yeah. We're not gonna do that. We're just gonna make this place safe. Okay, let's just ask ask the stranger. Hello there. Uh, I'm sorry, ma'am. The church grounds are closed for maintenance work. Hmm, well, it's about time too. The place was in need of some care and attention. Well, that's great. Uh, let me just go ahead and uh, go to the statue for a second because, uh, or not the journal. Um, why am I taking out the journal? No. Satchel. There you go. So I want to eat something very quickly because uh, also our health is really, really low. So I need to find something that can uh, do both of these things. There you go. Some canned uh, sweet corn. Very nice. Yeah, just throw that away. There you go. He seems more fine. Now, now he's uh, a little more health, healthier, or more happier. Okay, these guys are gonna come towards us. They better not have any trouble with us. Damn it! It's taking a while for him to dig up the grave. Come on, man. Just take your shovel and be done with it. Gentlemen, church grounds are closed. I don't care very much what they are. We're looking for some privacy. Uh, you get this guy. Let's just be hey, a little bit charming. We're closed for some uh, excavation work. Would you mind? No, I ain't gonna mind you at all. You carry on with your business. We'll carry on with ours. This fella. Oh, damn choir boy. Okay, let's just answer. Okay. Get the hell out of this churchyard. Are you boys going to need yourselves a preacher? You hear this fella? I heard him all right. We're going to lick you. Whoa. Gotcha, man. I was I was waiting for that moment to happen. But we got him back. Oh, yes. Look at these punches. Yes, that was very successful. That's what you get for being dumb. Actually, while we're at it, I'm also going to take your hat. Because my hat is for some reason gone. Or I'm just going to loot these bodies. Why not? And I'm also going to take your hat, so... Hang on, hang on, buddy. I'm just going to steal this ha guy's hat. Oh, there you go. Got a free hat. <laughs> that just really looks bad on me, but still. At least I'm happy that I at least got a hat. Okay, so did you, did you, did you got the stuff? Alright, well, here's your payment. Oh, forgive me, Mrs. Claypole. What you find? Well, she had a brooch here. It looks like diamonds. Oh, that's just wrong, man. Okay, take the diamond uh, brooch. That's uh, just wrong. Do. Really, Get dude? Or sees oh my god, that just looks terrible. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I'm out of here. Oh uh, yeah, I. Uh, you better get out of here. Okay, well, that was uh, that was really random. <laughs> and we're also going to loot some, loot, some uh, loot these bodies here that we uh, accidentally punched. 
And then we're gonna go. Uh, and then we're gonna go to the gun store and uh, do some. Uh, ooh, some salted beef. That guy got nice. So, uh, where is the gun store? That's the big question. What is it, buddy? Do you need any help? Hey, Mister. Oh, poor guy. Oh no. Let's give him a, a dollar. Poor guy. He doesn't have a leg. There you go, poor man. Say, say, where you from? Around. <laughs> Came from around here. If that was you, I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, ever since them, them greys moved here. They a bunch of no-good white trash. Yeah, they, they somehow got rich. About 50 years ago, they moved here, caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, I reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Interesting, man. Thank you for, uh... Giving us some uh, interesting information. But okay, uh, poor guy. I feel so bad for him. Okay, so we're gonna go to the gun store. And is it the right way? No, mister. Oh, what? I've been trapped down here. What? What are you doing there? Uh, hi. What, what are you doing? Here? Why are you dressed up like that? <laughs> I've seen some sick perversions in my time. This one might take the prize. Oh yes, it will. You've got to help me. It's that crazy gunsmith. He made me dress up like this. He got me chained to the goddamn foot. What a sick person. Well, that's a great that's a great time to do it right now because uh, I'm also going to go to the gun store and buy some stuff from him. Your first time in my shop? Okay, this guy looks really weird shelves, and funky. I keep the guns locked. Okay, well. Catalog and I'll pull out anything you'd like to see. Okay, well that's great, but I would like to go and. Uh, Been a mite suspicious about the new faces in town. Oh yes, I'm really. To be sure, but we can't just let all types have their way. <laughs> okay, but I'm also really suspicious about you, sir, because uh, you got an interesting person in your uh, in your basement. So what I'm gonna do is, um, uh, what should we do here? I have, okay, I'm maybe gonna upgrade the Lanchester here. Uh, the clean what okay, we're not gonna clean actually let's go ahead and clean it. There you go So what can we do here to this Lanchester uh, rifling? Uh, we can maybe oh, yeah, that's gonna increase the range a little bit uh, Should we do it? I'm gonna do it. Why not? Because we actually use because we sort of use our Lanchester quite a bit. So we're also gonna improve the site Why not? Uh, should we put a scope on it? Uh, no, it's not gonna really look great on this uh, beautiful Lanchester uh, we're also not gonna do anything to grip wraps. Oh, that that looks sort of nice, but nah, uh, I don't know. Doesn't really look good. Styles. Uh, we're not gonna customize a gun with uh, any unique wood, but we could maybe uh, upgrade the rounds on it. Maybe give it some more damage. There you go. That seem that's a that's a good thing. So we got some express rounds, and then uh, we're gonna go to our uh, carbine repeater because we also use that weapon a lot. So we're also gonna clean that up. Uh, we're also gonna upgrade the barrel, of course. We're gonna waste a lot of our money on the upgrades on our guns, but in the long run, should be worth it. So I'm also gonna... Uh, no, I'm not gonna mess around with the scope, and I think that should be it. We're not gonna waste all of our money. So, yeah. I'm just gonna back out of that. And I'm also gonna take a look at my revolvers if I can. No, it doesn't look like it, but let me go here and talk to this gunsmith. Let's actually aim a weapon. Well, Put your hands up. Now. That's a fool decision. Oh, we're not gonna rob you. I wanna see what's in that basement of yours. Show me. Right now. Nothing to no worse down there, I swear. Well, why don't I be the judge of that? Open it now! All right, all right. Hey, you better open that door, man. To hide. I got my boy sleeping down there. It's such a shame to wake him. Your boy, he's you know, sleeping. You can always come back after he wakes up. Show me the person that's in this basement. You, you just stay away from me. Now what I tell you. Whoa! Tell you what is going on here? Oh, oh, thank God. Uh, explain. See, I only do it for his own good. Can you please explain Thanks. 
Please help me. He, he's got me chained up Just here. What the hell is going on here? Yeah, what the heck he is going on here? Boy, stealing candy from the store again. It's for his own good. I'm not your little boy, you mad son of a bitch. Uh, are you? Uh, don't I don't know what to do. He's all I got. Let me question Why him. Are you wearing that sailor suit? That crazy maniac put me in it. He thinks I'm his kid's son. Kidnapped me, he did. Do I look like a kid? <laughs> Always in such a rush to grow up these days, aren't they? Man, just be quiet. I'm gonna save him. Um. Please don't listen to that maniac. <laughs> okay, l then, then let me point the weapon at the chain. Can't lose him. Not again. Okay, no. I want to aim a weapon. Because I, I can't spend another. There you go. Oh, oh, finally! Thank you, thank you. Oh, oh you, you I'm sorry. Son of a... Please forgive me. I know it was wrong. I just couldn't face that he was gone. Uh, what are you giving? Teaching Sammy how to hold the rifle proper out by the river. The recoil shot him backwards. Well, into the river. The water pulled him downstream so quick. It all happened so fast. I didn't know what to do. I searched up and down that river bank. For days. But I couldn't find my boy. I just miss him so much. And you! You remind me of him. You look just like him. What are you talking so about, sad. man? Please forgive me. It's too late for apologies. You just count yourself lucky that I don't kill you for what you did. You're a weirdo, man. You should be happy that I didn't kill you. Take what you want. I don't care anymore. Oh, well, thank you. Well, <laughs> I, I kind of feel bad for this guy, but let me just look inside of this weapon case. I'm sorry for that, but oh, wow. Um I think we sort of wasted our money a little bit because I found a better weapon here. <laughs> is that another Lanchester that we found? Hang on. Oh, yes it is. We have two Lanchesters right now. Uh, but the problem is, yes, we have two. Okay, well, that's weird. <laughs> we got two Lanchesters. So now we're going to reload this weapon. Uh, let's actually go ahead and look in this little uh, metal loot box. There better be something interesting here. Like a, a coin purse. That's nice. Oh, well, that's not a lot of money. A little bit. You're a weirdo, man. Like, look at these pictures. Why this room? Okay, buddy, I'm not gonna steal anything from you except for that weapon that I took, but yeah. What a weird guy. And also really unexpected. And we also got a weapon somehow. Okay, no! Why did you eat that? Okay, I, I just ate some big beans. Okay, I'm not gonna steal anything from this guy. What a poor guy, but at the same time, what a weirdo. So, yeah, guys, we are gonna end this video here. <laughs> really unexpected. Like, I just wanted to go to the gun store and just put some upgrades on our guns, but uh, I went here and I saw this little guy just uh, popping his head out in this uh, little window. And uh, what a weird go! Like, he, like it doesn't matter that he lost someone, but why do you have to do that? Just why? But okay, guys, we're gonna end off this video right here. So it would be very, very amazing of you if you could give this video a like. It'd be very, very appreciative of you, and I shall see you guys in the next video. Bye.